Hey, girlies. Hey, Chloe. We need to have a sleepover this weekend. You're right. Let's meet at your house. No, at like we're not having it at my house. Wait, why? Because, like, we always have it at my house, and I'm just, like, not feeling it anymore. And you guys always make a mess, so, like, we can do it at somebody else's house for once. We could do it at my house. Sorry, Jessica, we can't have it at your house. Wait, why not? Because you have, like, a brother, and you have a dad, and... I'm not allowed to go over to people's houses that have a brother and a dad. Wait, why not? Because, like, you don't know what her dad and her brother might do to me. What are you saying? My I'm family isn't going to do anything. anything. I just don't know for a fact. And we get to spend the night at Lily's. Lily has a dad and four brothers. Okay, yeah, but my mom knows her brothers and her dad. And, like, they're normal. Like, I don't know about your family, Jessica. So... Sorry about it. You're literally overreacting. Like, I just don't want something to happen to me in my sleep. I'm sorry. Anyway, we we're finally in your room. Has Jessica ever been in here? No. You didn't think so. I'm so glad your mom's finally taking our relationship seriously. But can we close the door? Because I want to cuddle with you, and I don't want your mom watching us. Because I know she's, like, jealous. Because, like, your dad and her just got a divorce. But, like... Can you not talk gosh. about it right now? Like, come on. Mm, sensitive topic? Yeah, kind of. Mm, I thought we were a big boy. Oh, Chad, I think we're going to have to redecorate the room because um, this is really nerdy and I just can't be seen in here. Like, if we're going to take a mirror selfie, I can't have that or that in the back. I don't want like, my other no. girls to see anyways. You definitely don't watch Star Wars. And can you put Why that down? Why are you so greedy? I do watch Star Wars and I'm just touching it. You have Gosh. to wash your hands first and you don't even know how to turn it on. See, I know what I'm doing. Can we, like, play or something? No. Why are you no fun? You play with Legos. My little brother, who's five, plays with Legos. Like, getting ready still and I don't like you to see me without any makeup on. What are you getting but ready for? We're getting ready for the Barbie movie. Oh my gosh, I already told you about this. You didn't tell me. I think I'd remember. Oh, you're so annoying, Chad. We're seeing the Barbie movie together tonight and we're both gonna wear pink because it's gonna be so cute. Ain't no way I'm wearing pink. Do you know how many boys would be so excited to see the Barbie movie with me and you're complaining about it? Like, grow up. Pink is for boys and girls and if you were masculine enough, you wouldn't be complaining about it because you're a little boy that can't get over himself because his girlfriend wants him to wear pink like you're literally so annoying and i want you to bring me a barbie to the barbie movie and some flowers and like can you pretend like you asked me to see the barbie movie like a good boyfriend because that's what a lot of good boyfriends are doing why do you need a dollar are you 12 i'm not 12 chad i just want to see the barbie but he finally called me i've been out of class all day and y'all didn't like wonder where i've been you weren't in class are you serious right now Anyways, yeah, my mom called me out of class. I've just been having, like, a really hard day, you know, like, when you need, like, a mental health day, you know? You guys probably wouldn't get it. Chloe, why are you drinking that high-calorie Starbucks drink? Does it even have oat milk? Well, and you have a croissant? I don't know, Ew. like, maybe I'm just, like, depressed, you guys. Like, why are you such bullies? You know why I'm probably depressed? Because Jessica is always so mean to me. Did you get diagnosed by a doctor? No, but that doesn't matter. I literally am. I cried today. I don't even think I brushed my teeth. Ew. And I couldn't come to class. So, yeah, I definitely am. You wouldn't know how it is. Literally. I gotta go. I told you multiple times, I don't want to talk to you. Why? Because uh, I don't have to give you a reason, okay? Just, like, respect my boundaries. Can you just tell I'm me? I'm fine. It's because I'm mad at you. What did I do? <sighs> like, you don't even know. Okay, so you know how you were over my house the other day? Yeah. When you got up to go to the bathroom while I scrolled on your phone? Wait, what? Shut up, okay? I had this suspicion. Okay, I had this gut feeling that something was going on. So, yes, I went through your phone like any good girlfriend would. I went through your Instagram, and I saw your top searches, and Summer Ray's name was there. So, like, obviously I was curious, so I clicked on her profile, and I saw that you liked multiple bikini pictures of her. Now, you know how she makes me feel. Like, I'm so insecure already, and that just, like, made me way more insecure about myself. No, that's practically cheating. You know what? You don't have a girlfriend anymore, Chad, so you don't have to worry about it. Go slide into Summer Rae's DMs for all I can. Literally so obnoxious. Hey, Miss Smith, bestie girl, sorry we're late. We could not find your new room. We didn't even know you moved rooms. Um, no, we didn't go to the vending machine. We literally could not find your classroom. So, I got these from my locker. I'm not lying, Lily, stop. Anyways, what are we doing? 
Oh, we're introducing ourselves? Oh, I interrupted someone? Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. But like, could you like all start over for us? Because like, I don't know some of you guys and I want to get to know everyone. Can I start though? Like I can just introduce myself, Miss Smith? Well, why not? Oh, we're going in alphabetical order? Okay, so who's first? She was going, can you just start over for us? Because like, I want to get to know you. Okay. Can you just speak up a little bit? I didn't catch her name, Miss Smith. I don't, like, can she speak up? Or, like, could you tell me? Because, like, she's really, sh you're really shy. The so boys are eating lunch with us today. Oh, yeah. my gosh. Here you go, Lily. Thanks, girl. Here you go, Jessica. You definitely need that. Um, thanks. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. When are they coming over here? Soon. Give that back. Hey, what's up? Oh my gosh! Hey, boys! How are you guys? I miss you, shawty. You. you guys haven't ate with lunch with us in a really long time. I know. Uh, do you guys see what's on Jessica's lips? It looks like know. she's wearing lip gloss. Is that? I wouldn't know. Yeah, me either. Yeah, we wouldn't know. We don't just, like, cake our faces like that. You literally gave me the makeup out of your Stop bag. lying, Jessica. <laughs> Lily, here's a green juice. Boys like if you eat clean. It's so gross, though. I know, just... Inhale, you'll be fine. Yo, what is yeah, that? Yeah, I'm drinking a green juice. It's really good for you. Would you like a sip? What are you having for lunch? Oh, just a salad. I have one every day. No, you don't. Because I'm just really disappointed in us. Wait, why? Because we were supposed to all go to Pilates this morning. I was so excited to work out with my girls before school this morning, and neither of you guys bothered to show up because we want to sleep in. Well, guess what, ladies? You don't get a hot body sleeping in. You don't get a boyfriend sleeping in. So I want to see you both tomorrow in this Pilates parking lot. I mean, Lily, like, you get an excuse because, like, you know, you have a good metabolism and you're quite teeny, so you can have a couple off days. But, Jessica, there is no excuse. Like, I know I don't have a good metabolism, so I put in the work at Pilates. You know, all these girls that are body positivity, they're getting a check. Like, Hailey Bieber is not missing a day at Pilates. So get your butt here tomorrow because I'm not going to have friends that are just unmotivated. Like, I want you guys to get your back at school. I was so worried about mm -hmm. you. Were you sick yesterday? Yeah. Yeah, I can tell your hair is so messy. Let me fix it for you. Much Stop better. Stop flirting. He's dating Jessica. Oh, my gosh, you guys. Stop. You're making me blush. He's literally just my boy bestie. Ow. Isn't that right, Lukey? No. Anyways, I didn't even know they were dating. You think that's something you would tell your girl bestie, right? Unless you have, like, a crush on me. No. Oh, my gosh, I'm so literally sad. joking, you guys. It's a joke we have. Anyways, Lukey, I was so sad you weren't at school yesterday because you couldn't see the nail color that you picked out for me. You actually got them yeah, done. Yeah, I got them done. Aren't they so cute? Yeah, they're dope, well, I guess. Don't try to hold my hand or anything. I mean, you have a girlfriend. You grab mine. I'm just kidding. Um, Luke, our streak's about to end, so make a cute face. Yeah, Jessica, don't be jealous. We have, like, a 30-day streak going. Lily, would you just, like, slow down? I did Pilates yesterday with my mom, and my legs are killing me. I told you this. No, so, like, Jessica the other day, she's being so obnoxiously rude. And, like, I'm trying to be better because I've been going to church with, like, my neighbors. And, like, I'm learning, like, to try and be kind to people because I heard, like, Jessica's, like, really hard. But to she's me. really hard to me. See, I feel like there should be exception. And, like, I feel like my sins shouldn't be, like, I shouldn't get punished at the end of my life because somebody else is obnoxious. Exactly. Like, it's not my fault. She's the one. Literally. Oh, she's FaceTiming me right now. Literally such an inconvenience. Oh my God. Hi, Jessica. Jessica. Shh, she's not supposed to know I was hanging out with you. I told her that I was busy today. No, I. that's my sister. And my mom told us we had to go outside. That's why I'm obnoxiously loud. Oh, it's because she's over. Hi. I told you to, like, stop having your little friends over all the time because they're so annoying. They give me a headache. Also, you guys need to be quiet because mom's sleeping and she just got off of work. And if I get yelled at for y'all being loud, y'all are going to get it, okay? Because I need to go to my friend's party tonight. Anyways, Kimberly, why did you let your little friend drink out of my Stanley? That's absolutely disgusting. She's getting her germs all over it. We have cups in the cupboard. Don't take my Stanley, okay? And you can give your friend a cup of your own if she needs to drink out of a Stanley. That's absolutely disgusting. And also, 
He's eating my snacks. These are mine. Oh my gosh, Kimberly, you're literally so annoying. And she's wearing my blanket. Can you hand it over? I'm not gonna be able to go out tonight. No, I'm being really quiet because, oh my gosh, you guys are annoying. You're literally gonna get me in trouble. Why can't you like put the volume up on your phone? Mom, I'm not talking to anybody. Literally, get out of my room. You're so annoying. No, I'm grounded. So I'm not going to Jessica's pool party birthday thing. I'm not making up excuses because I don't want to go. I literally rather go right now. And that is saying a whole bunch because I don't like Jessica. I literally got her a whole birthday present and everything because I'm trying to be nice. But I'm grounded because my mom, she is so annoying. She like doesn't give me an allowance or anything. So I went to the nail salon and since I have no money and I'm not getting a job because I'm 14 and it's summer and I'm a girl and like that's just torture. So I went and got my nails done and I didn't pay and then they called my mom and she's like so annoying now and she told me I stole. Like I didn't steal. So I can't I thought, why not show you guys how I put in my hair extensions? So I get my hair extensions from Fire Hair. It's a shop on Amazon, and they're super easy to put in. So I already sectioned off my hair, and I'll show you guys how I put them in. So I started by opening the clips, and then I'm just going to go around my head. I have, like, the bigger one going first, and I'm just going to clip that all around my head. Okay, I know it looks a little wonky right now, but you got to trust the process. I'm going to put another one in. This is how it looks so far. We're going to do the next layer. This is 24 inches, you guys. I'm feeling so bougie. I'm gonna put the rest in. And here's my hair with all the extensions in. I think it looks absolutely gorgeous, so definitely check them out. They have so many different colors. Like, look how well this color matched me. I'll have everything tagged below. Snapchat! Hey, uh, where did you get that worksheet from? I got it from over there. Oh, okay, thanks. So why aren't you, like, going over there and getting the paper since I just told you where it was? I don't know. I'm just a little nervous to, like, get up at the moment. You're nervous to get up and grab a paper? I mean, I'll go get it for you, but, like, you need to function as a human being. My God. Here you go. Um, thank you. You're welcome. I just have really bad anxiety, so... I yeah, well, my mom told me anxiety's not a real thing, so get over it. Chloe, that was really I'm rude. I'm not being mean, you guys. Gosh. You say you have anxiety all I the time. I do it as a joke. I don't really have issues like this girl over here who can't function in society. Excuse me? No offense. It's just like, why can't you walk across the room and get something for yourself? Are you five? Gosh. I have anxiety. Oh, yeah. You have an illness. I'm sorry. Chloe, stop. It's not me. Come sit next to me. Miss Smith, why are we even here? Like, it's not even a pep rally or something, so why are we, like, in the gym? We're here for an assembly. Why? We're going to talk about bullying that's been happening in the school and how to be nice to each <laughs> Is this play about us? Excuse me, ladies. <laughs> ladies. I'm sorry, Miss Smith. Continue. This is not something to joke so about. No, I know it's not a joking matter. I know. Oh my gosh, Lily, I kind of feel bad now. For what? Like, after the assembly. Because you're a bully? No, I don't think I'm a bully. I literally post Jesus quotes on my Snapchat all the time and Instagram. Like, I'm not a bully. I mean, you are a bully to Jessica, like, all Kayla, the time. Kayla, I'm not. Stop. Anyways, maybe Jessica should apologize to us. She's just sitting there, like, unbothered. Chloe, I think you are Miss bullying Smith, her. I'm not bullying Jessica. I literally... What are you guys talking oh, about? Yeah, Jessica, we're just talking about my lightsaber. I told you guys I had one at home. I just didn't want to bring it. But, yeah, you're not so cool after all, Jessica. Boys want to take turns holding yeah. it. Yeah, is that a Mandalorian? What? No, this isn't Amanda's. It's mine, obviously. That better have been a joke. You know it's a Mandalorian? Oh, it's Amanda. Yeah, I, I know that, you guys. If there's someone who doesn't know a thing about Star Wars and likes to pretend they do, it's Jessica. What? She said one time, you guys, I don't want to embarrass her, but she said, Luke, you are my no dad. Way, but I never <laughs> said that. No, you really did say that. You did. Anyone that is a true Star Wars fan knows that Luke, you are my father, is not even a real line. That is true. Yeah, I know everything about Star Wars. I'm using the drunk elephant glow drops. So now that I'm in eighth grade, everyone needs to stop being a little baby. There's this one girl in my class that I literally cannot stand. And I'm not trying to be mean or anything. I can usually tolerate people, but this one girl, absolutely not. And I don't want to name names or anything, but her name is Jessica, and she's so fake. That's literally one of my biggest pet peeves, being fake. 
So me and my besties Lily and Kayla caught her in the biggest lie yesterday. We are not on speaking terms. So this girl literally had the nerve to start a rumor that my boyfriend is cheating on me. I'm all about girls supporting girls, but she's saying my boyfriend likes her and she's literally not cute at all. Like, no threat to me. So I'm going to confront her in front of the whole yeah, gosh, What is everyone staring at? <gasps> Jessica, oh my gosh, you broke your arm. Poor baby. I know, right? I'm literally just kidding, you guys. Stop giving her attention. I literally broke my arm when I was five years old and I survived. So she'll be okay. But let me be the first to sign your cast, Jessica. Come here. Let me put a big heart. How cute. <laughs> Wait, Chloe, why would you write that? That's really rude. Oh, my gosh. You guys don't understand. I'm not being mean. That's an inside joke that me and Jessica had. Literally, chill out. Like, would I ever be mean on purpose? I don't understand the inside no, joke. No, I wouldn't. So, Jessica, who are you going to ask to leave early with you so, like... Um, they can take your books down because like I'll definitely take your books like we can go together like I want to leave early Also, you guys she's probably faking it. So like Happy I get to spend the night. Yeah, me too Yeah, just what's wrong? I wish I like would have told my mom that I was spending the night before because like I didn't pack a bag or anything I mean you're in a hoodie, so you're good. No, this hoodie is just like really uncomfortable but um. Earlier, when you were going through your closet, I saw... Oh my gosh, I am right. You just got that really cute hoodie. Yeah, oh, this that one, one from PacSun. I've really, I've really been wanting to wear this. It's so cute. Ooh. Yeah, but there's a stain on it, so you wouldn't want to wear that. Oh, there is a stain on it. Well, I don't mind, but, like, this would be way more comfy to sleep in. I mean, the hoodie you're wearing looks a lot more comfy. Nah, this would be way more comfy. Can I also wear this to school on Monday? Like, can I take it home? Like, I promise I'll bring it back. I mean, you could, but it's, like, dirty and... No, it's I fine. Thanks so much. I'll walk in on my selfie. Oh, my God, that's so cute. I'm going to post it on my story. Oh my gosh, Jessica, watch what you're doing with that big glow stick. You almost hit me. You're such a freak. No, she's not, and it's actually pretty cool. What do you mean that's, like, cool? It's cool? I mean, that's totally cool. What, what are you guys talking about? Star Wars. Star Wars? No, 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 no. Yeah, that's from Star Wars. No, I watch it all the time. Sure. Oh my gosh. What you called you, it a no, glow stick. I called stick. it a glow stick to be funny. Oh my gosh, you guys literally can't get a joke, can you? No, I have, like, a million of these in my house. I literally do. Let me see how you use this. Yep, see? I know exactly what I'm doing. See? Calm down, bro. Okay, take this back. I don't want that anymore. Anyways, I know, like, all the quotes. Like, Luke, you are my dad. Like, I she literally know all of them. Right so, like, I'm so cool. I watch all of them. <laughs> Why yeah, are you okay. laughing at me? You know what? Miss Smith, Jessica has a big toy that's distracting everyone. I think you should take Who hasn't gone yet? Um, Jessica. Oh, Jessica? All right, you get in there, babe. Oh, no, I'm not going to take a shower. No, you're good. Like, we'll literally wait for you. We're not going to talk about you or anything, but we do want to get breakfast, so, like, hurry it up. And no, I just don't like showering at other people's no, houses. Jessica, that's disgusting. You literally slept in my bed, you sweat in your sleep, and you're just going to leave that all over your skin? Get in the shower. Can I use no, those? No, nobody's using my patches. Why? Because I said so. Anyways, why are you not in the shower yet? I forgot my underwear. That's what it's all about? You forgot some panties? You can borrow mine. Um, no, thank you. I don't borrow people. Are you trying to say I'm gross or something? No. Because if anything, I should be offended by letting you borrow my panties. Here you go, girly. I don't want them back, so consider it a gift. Um, I don't wear those. You don't That's... wear those? You mean a thong? Yeah. Okay, I'll get you a few. What? What's wrong? I can't with you. What? Come here, what's no, wrong? don't try to touch me. My knees are pointed this way for a reason. Literally, no, I just sense, like, something's off. You had a girl in here, didn't you? What? No. Don't lie to me, oh. Chad. I knew you were cheating. I should have listened to Lily when she said, our signs don't align. Like, we shouldn't be together. The, like, moon and the stars and the everything says so. Bro, why are you messing all my stuff up? Aha! Uh -huh. Okay. You are cheating on me. What are you talking Idiot. about? It's my hand sanitizer. No, because why would you have hand sanitizer in your cart? You don't even care about washing your hands, let alone putting hand sanitizer on. You're a dirty boy. It's my mom's? No, it's not. You don't even spend time with your mom. That's why you haven't been seeing me as much, huh? You ignored me all day yesterday. I told you this. I was at my grandma's funeral. Lies! Your grandma's not even dead. I saw her car pulled up your driveway. We just haven't sold it yet. It's been a day. Hey, what are you I'm doing? just doing my makeup. 
You missed, like, a lot of spots. Okay, I'm not done yet. Anyways, you could be dating a crusty girl named Jessica who doesn't even look like she takes care of herself, so you should be lucky to have hey. me. Anyways, before you rudely interrupted me, I wanted to tell you how Travis Kelly is dating Taylor Swift. Or should I say she's dating him, definitely, because she made whoa, him... Whoa, 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 you mean Travis okay, Kelsey? That's what I said. Anyways, stop interrupting me. It is so rude. But she, like, made him who he is because... Like, he was, like, a nobody before. Like, I think he's definitely using Are her. Are you serious? He's a football player. He oh, he does? Football. I didn't even know that. It's because she literally made him. Like, he must have not been that good at football. Anyways. Are you serious right now, dude? Stop yelling at me. You know what? You support Kanye. Like, that is so gross. You're not a girl supporting girls type of guy. Like, you see how he treats Kim Kardashian? And now Taylor's getting treated bad and you don't even want to listen? No, because you're stupid and you literally don't even know what's stop. coming out of your stop mouth Stop yelling right now. at me. Yes, is Chloe. this legit real? Because we didn't get a warning, and my anxiety is through the roof right now. It doesn't matter. Let's just get oh, moving. Yay. Well, I have to grab my stuff, and I have to get my Duncan. It's cold outside, isn't it? I need a jacket. You don't need that stuff. We okay, need fine, to leave. I'm walking. Uh, Lily, come by me. Hey, Chloe, don't worry. This is definitely a Jessica, drill. Jessica, don't even try to be my friend right now. I was really hoping you got burned up in the fire. Guess dreams don't come true, do they, Lily? <laughs> Guess they don't. You guys need to walk Yo, a little faster, me. okay? So cold. Of course, our school is so ghetto, ours would burn down. Wait, Miss Smith? Yes, Chloe. Has anybody seen Chatty Chat? He's not even in our classroom, well, Chloe. Well, I know that, but I need to find him and make sure he got out safely. I'm sure he's safe. And do any. I'm tired, you guys. <laughs> I think that was good, yeah, yeah. Anyways, good morning, you guys. I'm talking quiet because I don't want to wake my family. But today we're doing a get ready with me for sixth grade. I'm going to be telling you guys how I embarrassed this boy at my school yesterday. On accident, of course. So basically, I walked into my fifth period class yesterday. And everybody was like, Chloe, Chloe, you have a crush on Lucas. And I was like, ew, Lucas is so gross, you guys. No, I don't. Then everybody was saying I was so mean for calling him gross. I don't get the whole we gotta be nice to everybody thing. Hey. Girls that support girls. Now, don't twist my words. I'm just saying there's no way you can like every girl in this entire world. So, first of all, you're a liar. And second of all, you're really fake for that. When you're Snapchatting a boy for a while and then you randomly get a weird Snapchat from some girl with her crusty white tongue sticking out in her clumpy eyelashes saying, Don't talk to my man. Uh, it's embarrassing that I didn't even know he had a girly. He's obviously not that into you. And I'm not threatened. Girls that try to say girls don't poop. I'm not a part of that bandwagon because that's honestly disgusting. Like, what are you, just going to explode one day? Girl named... Jessica, I mean, do I need to explain? I'm sure they're all bitches. Boys that are getting mad at girlies for watching football because of Taylor Swift. I mean, if she wasn't important to the football community, why would they show her 20? You're late. Did you at least bring my Starbucks? Yes. See if you got it right. Hmm, surprisingly. Get in line, stretch, get ready. Why can she be late? She gets to be late because she brought me Starbucks. Now, Kayla, mind your business. Do you bring me Starbucks when you're late? No, you just tell me how your mom's car broke down. Who cares? Kayla, just for that, get in the back. Jessica, you get to be a little bit more forward. Bring your A game on. And tell your mom to get a better car, Kayla. It's literally embarrassing. It's one, three, five. Not one, two, three. Who counts like that? attention to math class and didn't learn your odds. Why are you raising your hand, Lily? Why are we in your kitchen? So fat. You're literally just oversized. Lily, do you think it makes me look fat? No. Why would you say that, Kayla? Here, look at the tag. It's literally an extra small. Hey, guys. Oh, my gosh. Hi, Jessica. How are you? Oh, I'm I good. didn't even hear your footsteps, surprisingly. I know. She's usually stomping. I mean, right. <laughs> Hey, where should I put this dish? Oh my gosh, your mom brought a dish? Oh my gosh, how thoughtful. You literally shouldn't have. Like, actually, my mom knows how to cook. Um, is this from a box? No, homemade. Are you sure? Well, yeah. I'll put it over here. Okay, thanks. Lily, come help me over here. Yeah, you can come too, Kayla. 
Don't you think it's so rude? Her mom brought a dish. She's basically saying my mom doesn't know how to cook. Hey, ladies, help yourself. I already see Jessica is. You're just putting it on there. Oh, sorry. Oh, I'm glad you like my mom's cooking. It's flattering. Wow, Jessica, diving in before we even get to pray. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. When I ask if you're going to eat all that and you get offended. Obviously, by the way you reacted to what I was asking, you're embarrassed and you just got a reality check that you probably shouldn't be eating that much. So your waist is going to think me. You ask for somebody's opinion and you choose the other option and they literally get butt hurt. Sorry, you're bad at giving advice. I feel like they literally do that on purpose. So whoever is giving you the wrong opinion is literally a fake friend. When some random girly in your class comes up to you that you've never even associated yourself with and she says, oh my gosh, we're wearing the same top, twins. Like, it's not that cool you shop at Lulu too. Why are you telling me? When we're checking papers at school and you say, change the answers for me. Like, you're not my friend like that. You're getting the bad grade you Packages, yes. Why are you opening my packages? Matthew, do not talk to me that way. I can open a package if I want to. Not if it's not yours. Well, does it have your name on it? It literally does. I don't care. It looks like you got more lightsaber stuff. This is so cool. If you have so much stuff, you can definitely let me borrow something. Can what you just stop these? touching everything? Can you stop? Let me look. You've looked I'm enough. literally tell mom how you're failing math if you don't stop. No, you won't. Yeah, I will. So these are different handle things? Yeah. So that means I'm going to get so many boyfriends? i will literally impress them all. And this is a lightsaber, isn't it? Be careful with those scissors. This is so cool. You're going to have to teach you guys why I'm grounded right now and I have, like, no rights in my own home. First of all, it all started with me having to take driver's ed at the age of 14 years old and having to do it every single day after class. Like, I'm supposed to have a social life. I'm literally a teenager. I asked my mother, or should I say Kelly, to drive me and my friends Lily and Kayla to the mall. But she couldn't even do that simple task of being a mother and taking her daughter to the mall. And she doesn't think I'm going to have some resentment at her for that. And obviously Lily and Kayla's mom couldn't do it because they actually have real jobs. My mom stays at home. What does she have that's more important? I decided to take our BMW to the mall with my friends. Like, I am in driver's ed, and so is Lily and Kayla. They can direct me with me. Lily's also getting ready over there. Yeah. Yeah. So basically, my mom's being such a bitch. Literally the biggest bitch. Mm-hmm. Drunk elephant glow drops. So she basically told me, here you go, Lily, Thanks, that girl. I can't have a sleepover with my boyfriend of two years because we're not mature enough. Then my mom has the nerve to say I'm always on my phone. Well, if I get to spend the night with Chad tonight, we don't have to fall asleep on the phone together. And then your phone bill will be less. So I'm making absolutely perfect sense. Here you go, Lily. Thanks, babe. But she doesn't want to treat me like I'm an adult. So I'm going to be an adult tonight and make my own decision. And I'm going over to Chad's. So Lily's going to stay here tonight and cover for me. I thought me. I was going. Why did you think that's so good? And why is that? Because my mom woke me up for this therapy appointment that I literally don't need. Like, I don't have a mental illness. She's such a gaslighter. You should know what that means since you're a therapist. Anyways, I know, like, you're taking time out of your day to help me, but I'm not the one that needs help. You know, there's a girl named Jessica at my school that I think she could really use your number, and I feel bad for taking away your time with people that actually need help, so... Do you have, like, a hotline I can send her? What is all that noise? You need to be in a quiet area. Yeah, that's my therapy dog. Do you hear it in the background? I just that's said That's the did. dog that you said I needed? Yes, you did. She's crazy. I heard from your mother that you're getting in trouble at school for bullying a girl on TikTok. No, I'm an influencer, and I'm trying to have creative ability, and Mr. McClee, our principal, is taking that away from me. I'm not a bully, and you know what? It's making me depressed. Okay, let's take deep breaths. I don't need deep breaths. I need medication, something I can send. Girlies, okay. what are you guys talking about? Well, I don't know. We don't want you to get upset. Oh, so you're not going to tell me? Are you guys talking badly about me? No, no, never, never. That's what I thought, because I know we're all besties here. Yeah. Anyways, why are you so excited, Jessica? Um, Me and Chad started dating. Oh, that's so cute. I'm so happy for you. She's not upset, you guys? Why do you guys think I'd get mad? Anyways, I broke up with Chad a long time ago. I mean, technically we're on break, so he's probably just trying to do a little rebound, but... No, I'm really happy for you. Thanks. No, I truly am. Uh, thanks.
<laughs> oh my gosh, Chloe, you're terrible. <laughs> stop. Go Chloe, tell her. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, I can't. I can't keep this, this in so anymore. Funny. I can't. Stop. Why are you guys laughing Anyways, at me? Um, no. The reason why I'm laughing is because Chad pranked you. He's what? actually still dating me, and he doesn't want to go out with you. And you're a bad friend for saying yes. So Wait, actually, we're not friends. Package. This Christmas, I wanted to do something really special for Chatty Chad. So I got something custom made because I'm like the best girlfriend in the world. Got it custom made from Bean Cases. So I'm going to show you guys what it is and then the little backstory on it. So here it is. I got one for me and Chatty Chad. Here's what they look like. They're basically an Apple playlist of your favorite song and your favorite person. How cute. I mean, come on, Jessica. Look how he's looking at me. <laughs> Anyways, so basically how that became our song is Chatty was mad at me one day and he posted that on his story and we were literally broken up at the time Only for a day, but honestly the song was towards me and I know it the song has so many mean things like I move mountains for you and she's pretty but ghetto I'm not nothing can tear us apart. So it's literally just a joke So Merry Christmas Chatty Chad. These will look so cute on my dresser and yours. You better put it in your room Anyways, I also had to get something for myself because basically the whole gift was for him, even though I got one too. So I got myself a phone case as well because they also make phone cases. And this one is absolutely adorable for the winter. Like, that is so cute. That screams it, girl. So let me put it on my phone. What it looks like on my phone, so incredibly cute. Chad's probably not even going to get me this nice of a gift. So had to get it for myself. Make sure to use my code and everything. It'll be on the screen. Love you guys. Love being cases. They're the best for Christmas presents. And move over. I'm not in frame, no, they though. can see you. You're literally in frame. You're just so close to me. Move that way. Hey, you guys. You guys on live? Yeah, we are live right now. Tell them I say hey. Lily says hey. Can we say Lily right now? Here, move no, first Lily, time. get out of frame because Why? you're practically naked and nobody wants to see that. Like, your nipples look so weird. Why are you so mean? It was a joke, Lily. I'm practically whispering. Nobody even heard me. The girl on your left is so pretty. Thanks, guys. Uh, they can't even see you, okay? You're not even in frame. So they were talking to me. Um, Thank you so much. Yeah, I'm more towards the left. Anyways. Is this sleigh? Ooh. Is that Zara jacket mine? Yeah. Well, does it make me look like that? What do you no, mean? No, you just look like extra wide. Not in a mean way. Okay, anyways, we're gonna get off. Just getting ready for school in my little vanity that I made my mom buy me because she doesn't think I'm a beauty influencer. But guess what, mom? I just got a PR package from Glow Recipe. Yeah, that's right, Glow Recipe. So let's unbox this together, but she really can't say I'm not an influencer, so... I should be able to skip school over this. Look how cute. I'm literally obsessed. You guys see how many things are in there? I swear if my mom has to borrow one of these, I'm going to be really upset. I literally just took a Snapchat of that. Jessica's going to be so jelly. Okay, now I have to be serious because we are an influencer here. This is the Plum Plum Hyaluronic Cream. Look at the packaging. Then we have the Watermelon Dew Drops. You, like, really love me. Then this is the Avocado Cleanser. Going to have better skin than Jessica, of course. Pore tightening toner, bright eye cream, firming serum, and a lip balm gloss. All jokes aside, I'm absolutely obsessed that Glow Recipe sent me something, and I'm super thankful. I just wanted to do a fun, funny POV for you guys, but I actually truly am obsessed, and these will make the funniest POVs, so I actually have, like, the cool stuff that people use in their get ready with me's. So thank you so much, Glow Recipe. Definitely check them out. I will have them linked down below. Do is your this. camera set up? Yes, I'm all set up and everything. Do I just, like, continue with my get ready with, with me and pretend like it never happened? Just, like, turn off the comments? Or do I have to, like, make a video? I think both at the same time. Okay. Why are you asking me? You're because the Because you're a little bit more selfless than I am. I don't really care about people's feelings that much. Okay, you guys, be quiet. I'm about to start. And Jessica, you know your part, so I'll let you know when you can speak. Hey guys, welcome back to another Get Ready With Me. As you guys can already see, I have my base done. And I am using this foundation right here. Sponsor me, Rihanna. As you guys can see, I'm powdering my face. And that's because it's catching literally every single tear that's in my eye right now. Because the hate comments are really brutal. Yeah, I'm talking about my last video. You guys were really in the comments. I literally had to disable them. And I have tough skin. 
I mainly disabled them because you guys were so in the wrong. Like, you guys got the story so wrong. Chloe, you can't tell them that they're wrong. Why not? Because they're not. They literally were wrong. It doesn't matter, but you can't say that. Okay, fine. I'll, I'll edit it out. Oh my gosh, Chloe, that's really good. Get into character. Oh, I'm actually crying. Why? Because I'm starting to think if I actually am canceled or whatever, then I'm going to make no money. And like... I know I'm going to marry Chad one day, but I can't be a housewife. I don't want to have a million babies and, like, cook dinner. Like, I thought I was going to be an influencer and have a family channel with one kid. One! Okay, well, save those tears for the video. Oh, you're right. Okay, i got to keep the tears in my eyes. Okay, so I had to cut the clips because I'm really sad. Also, Morphe sponsored me. Don't say that. Stop. But for those of you saying I'm really mean to my friend Jessica, she's actually here right now and we're really good friends. And like, I would never do anything to be a bad friend to her. We're like four lifers. Right, Jessica? <clears throat> right? Oh, Jessica? yeah. Now I have to edit this. And the tears are drying up. I'll use a setting spray. Right, Jessica? Right. Chloe would never do anything to hurt me. Okay, and then say, look, I'm a really good friend. She's a really good friend. So as you guys can see, we're all a good group of girlies. We literally make fun and know how to joke around all the time. You guys just took that video out of context. It will also be linked down below so you guys can get it to more views. Because if it was so controversial, I don't know why I didn't get more views. But um, yeah, thanks for watching. Love you guys so much with my whole heart. Don't skip the ads. Was that good? So good. You're going to be know, uncanceled. Okay, Jessica, you can go home now. No, like what I got for Christmas haul. Now, I would do a disclaimer like everybody else, but my family's apparently poor this year, so I don't think it's necessary because who's going to get jealous from that? First, I got a couple bags from Lulu. Only a few. I got this scuba jacket, and I don't know. It has so much fuzz. Like, my mom probably got this from, like, Goodwill or something. She says it's just fuzzy because there was another shirt in the bag, but I don't believe her. Next, I got a couple of things of the Laneige, but I'm really bummed out because I really wanted the Summer Fridays. Like, why couldn't you just spring for a few more dollars? They're like 40 Next is Ugg Ultra Minis. I'm really disappointed about this one because who wears this color? I'm embarrassed to wear these around, and apparently my mom thinks this is what's in. Valentino Perfume. I don't know. It smells like a grandma. And apparently I have some stuff back ordered from Gucci. But... Mommy, I've been ready. I just need to change my outfit. Lils, you look so hot. Thank no, you. you're literally serving. Oh my gosh, Jessica, we don't have time for this. Time for what? No, look at yourself. You're not even ready. Yes, I am. What do you mean you're ready? You're absolutely not. Your hair looks crazy. I just wanted to wear it natural today. Okay, I get we're all for natural, but that doesn't mean we're actually natural. We're in our clean girl era. You either wear your hair straight or in a slick back ponytail. Oh my gosh. At least brush your hair. You can't brush oh, curls. You can brush it. Sit still. Has your mother taught you nothing? Gosh, Ow. she's like you've never brushed your hair ever. Can you stop? Okay, maybe it doesn't look any better. Told you. I don't know. I don't have these problems. I don't have hair that's like that. Here, straighten it and make sure to get the back because that's going to be embarrassing if you don't. And don't try to say me and Lily have never helped you out because we're being really good friends. Now put some lip gloss on. Giving. My family is literally going to be here in five minutes, but I literally don't care. I'm curling my hair because if I don't, I'm literally going to look like an ugly little rat. Why does it look like this? It's not, oh my god. This is for my exes who don't give a shit about me. So you asking how I curl my hair? I literally just do that and then it turns out beautiful. I'm literally having so much anxiety. My hair like looks like shit. Also, I'm going to brush it out. So like literally don't come at me for that. But I have to do my makeup. I know I only have like 10 minutes. But I'm like absolutely hating my nails. Should I like repaint them? They're just not the vibe. Now for my outfit. This skirt or this skirt? Here's the fit. I absolutely hate it, but I gotta go. With me and Lily. Say hey, Lily. Hey, Chloe's TikTok page. Hey, you guys, it's Jessica. I'm here, too. <laughs> <laughs> like, literally, like, she wants to be famous or something, Lily. Literally. No, that's so oh, sorry. Cute. No, interrupt all you want. I can cut the clips. It's literally because you just got PR. I know, right? Like, literally, everyone wants to be like me. Everyone at school was so jelly. I'm, like, famous, kind of. Oh, me and Lily are getting ready because her mom's going to take us to Target to shop for our boyfriends. And Jessica's just tagging along. She doesn't have a boyfriend. Be quiet. 
We also got Chick-fil-A, you guys. It was so good. Lily's not dating. Uh, she literally is. Who? Lucas. They're not together. So what? It's on the DL, but she's claiming him. She likes him. So don't get how you always get. How do I uh, get? Trying to steal everyone's crushes. You forgot your stuff, Lily. We'll use any of mine. But that's Jessica's cool birthday party tonight? No. What? Girlie, you cannot be serious. She always goes okay, to yours. Before you all say that I'm a bad friend or whatever. Nobody said I that. I actually honestly would rather go to Jessica's right now because what? Why? I'm actually grounded and my mom's being so annoying. So literally hanging out with Jessica doesn't even sound like that bad of an idea. And I think I'm losing my mind because I said that. Don't be rude. Anyways, why are you grounded? Okay, yeah, you guys are why? so nosy. So I was trying to save my mom some money and stuff because she doesn't give me an allowance or anything. So like, how am I supposed to like have money? Like, I'm not going to get a job or anything like that. That's, like, crazy. That is really like, crazy. Not something for me. So I went to the nail salon, and I had a brilliant idea to just, like, go get my nails done and, you know, like, just, like, walk out and not, like, pay for what? it I never and so that. my mom says that's like a crime or something and she got really mad because they like called her up and then she had to pay for them or whatever and like she's just mad but like literally all she has to do is like give me an allowance or something and stop being so rude so talk about things i hate i just got done swimming at jessica's pool because lily and kayla are on vacation for after christmas with their families and I wasn't invited. But that's fine, because me and Jessica have been bonding, and honestly, Lily and Kayla, if you're watching this, she's honestly cooler than you guys, and I'm going to go on a trip with her family to Bora Bora for New Year's. Something I hate since I've been hanging out with Jessica is I let her do my makeup the other day because, honestly, hers didn't look that bad for once. But she decided to curl my eyelashes with her musty, dusty eyelash curler, and now my eyelashes are, like, non-existent. Don't even I see Chad because of it and I'm not like an insecure girl so this is really all new to me I never really had a reason to be insecure before but I got this really good eyelash serum so my eyelashes are gonna grow back before Lily and Kayla can even get off their plane the packaging is so pretty and I'm just gonna put this on Stubby together, thank you. Why did you say together? Well, I was just thinking it would be easier for the waiter instead of splitting the bill because obviously you have your card, right? Yeah. Yet all I have is cash and I only have enough just for my meal. So I was thinking you just put it all on your card and then I'll give you the cash. It's just like easier, you know? Not really. Okay, yeah. Let's go. 10.75. Oh, Okay. What? Can you hand me your card? Yeah, but why am I paying for both of because us? Because I'm driving right now. I'll give you the money back. I literally promise. Okay. Thank you. Um, let's park and eat over there. All right. We split the bill and I need my money because you never pay me back. What do you mean I never pay you back? You didn't no, last time. Literally, here's the money. We're going to need That's more. That's the exact amount it says on the Yeah, bill. but we need to split the chip, too. Tip? Okay, my treat today. Get whatever you want from Taco Bell. Where is it? Dude, what are you talking about? No, where Girl, is get it? out of my room right now. No, I'm telling mom, mom said I can be in here, so don't give me that attitude, okay? Or she said she's taking your PlayStation away. Stop messing up my room. Where what are it? you looking for? Just tell me. That light labor laser thing. I know you're a nerd. You have one. You even have one of these thingies. What? You know, that's from that show. You mean my lightsaber? Yeah, your light laser. You mean saber and because why? Because all the boys at school are raving because Jessica has one. And I need it because I stole yours last time and they thought it was the coolest thing. What do you mean you stole yeah, it? Yeah, I stole it. Big deal. Ha -ha. Get your hands you off know, of it. They told me I put on the blade wrong last time, so I need you to show me how to use this thing so they think I'm a pro. No, I'm not doing that. Sick. I'm going to get another boyfriend with this. Bye. I'm telling mom. Tell mom.